today I am going to show you guys how to make an automatic TNT cannon. And this is like what it's going to look like in the end. You can make it at any block you want. So let me show you how it works. You just flick this lever. And then the magic happens. So now I'm going to show you guys how to make this. So what you're going to need for this is a dispenser, TNT obviously, a lever, a pressure plate, redstone, what else, a lava bucket, and any block you want really, I like this block the most. And you're also going to need a redstone torch. So to start, just place your block, then the dispenser, and then the lever right there. And then go two blocks out, pressure plate there, and then make like a ring thing right there and put your lava in there. And now go two out with the redstone, three blocks there, redstone torch, redstone torch. And then it should start doing this. And then you go like Put the torches back there. Go like that. Put the redstone up there, and now it should look like this. Now to stop this, just press the lever. And this is pretty much all you have to do. Then you just put the TNT in there. But just to be safe so the TNT doesn't come back and blow this all up, I like to cover it up. You can really use any block you want, but bedrock doesn't really blow up, so I just use this. So if you're on like an OP faction server or something and you get bedrock in one of your kits or something, you can use this. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Make sure to leave a spot so you can click the lever though. So now let's just fill this in. And also make sure you don't do like that because then the redstone doesn't connect to that redstone. So just be cautious that you don't do that. Let's do that right there. So for this part, just go up one and do that. Oop. So now you are pretty much done. All you gotta do, put the TNT in there. So now, all you gotta do, flick the lever, and you just made what we made over there. Now just give it a second. So I'll see you guys next time.